explanation for the digital book current events article assignment. So you're going to be required to find at least four potential current event articles to use for the modern connection section of your paper. You're going to narrow this down to the two, the two best articles later on and summarize and provide commentary on them. Um, but for right now, it's always good to gather more information than you might need. So it's easier to toss something out than go back and start searching again. All right. So you will have to formally cite these sources, so you'll need to make sure that you um, are collecting all the information that you'll need. So um, you might want to consider having a separate page saved for work citations. That way um, you, you can just build them as you go. But this is kind of look a little like your annotated bib assignment that you completed in the first week of this project. All right. Um, what you'll do is so it is you're making that modern day connection to, to your big topic. So for example, um, the opioid, opioid, opioid crisis is something that is really affecting a lot of communities around the country and especially in Ohio. So you could find articles that help make that connection of that big topic and how that crisis is relevant still today or how, um, for example, women's issues, how they're relevant today. So you'll need to make sure that you're finding credible and reliable news sources. And this is something that I really want you to think about here. You want to make sure that they're unbiased, because if you remember from our research from week one of this unit, I said that you really need to make sure that you have, um, you want to use sources that are credible and unbiased. So. I really suggest using these are uh, these sources right here, such as PBS NewsHour Extra or NPR, because if you use sources such as MSNBC or Fox News, those are historically biased media sources. And while what they present is factual, what happens is they're biased, so they're only presenting certain facts, and I want you to get the whole story. So that's why I suggest using one of these sources right here. They should be very helpful and help you achieve what you're wanting to achieve for um, the, the purposes of this assignment. So you'll address what your um, big topic is, and then just like the annotated bib, you'll uh, you'll provide the web address where you found found the news source, the author's full name. It should <laughs> with the news article, it should have a full name. It should have an author's name, the full title title of the news article, the name of new, the news site or publishing organization, the date of the article is published. Since this is a modern connection, it should be within the past year or two. It should not be any older than that. Um, you want to make sure that um, you write down the date you access the article, a brief summary of the article's content, and then how is this ev event or incident relates to your topic. So you want to be so specific here because remember, all the notes that you're taking here are going to help you develop those paragraphs, which you're going to have to develop next week. If you have any questions at all about this assignment, just make sure you ask. I'm more than happy to help out. Thank you very much, and I look forward to seeing the information you gather for this assignment. Thanks.